Welcome to Catch App. I will be showcasing our event types. You will be able to find it here on the navigation bar. As a new user, this will only show the first event type you landed into to guide you to our core feature. But now, let's do it as you would normally would. Click on Create Event Type and you should find variables to edit. When creating an event type, there are a few variables to take into account to ensure the best outcomes. Like the appointment name, ensure it is clear, so when in the calendar, all parties can see and prioritize it. Next, the location. Where is the best place for this appointment? You can choose either through online, phone call, or in person. We also got a neat option here that allows you to add in a custom location too, useful for educators with a specific online tool that is not listed. Moving on. Adding valuable notes like an agenda or pre-appointment prep is extremely valuable to get all key information across. The duration of the appointment. When you want to offer availability. This is the most critical part, as this is where the platform shines, allowing you to allocate your availability just the way you want it. You can pick any day of the week and even time. Let's say I got a very complex schedule and I can't offer the same availability in all days. We'll click this and you can allocate availability accordingly to each day. Whether you require buffers before and after appointments, this can come in handy to block availability from being booked in. How far into the future attendees can see your availability with my availability control? Putting a buffer to not be booked on the spot. Limiting the number of appointments in a time period. Do you want text reminders on? You can by ticking this box. You and your attendees will receive this 24 and 2 hours before the appointment. No need to worry if you missed the email one. Are you asking qualified questions? Tick this box and you can add as many qualifying questions you require to qualify your attendees. Do you want to take payments for this event type? If connected to Stripe, you will be able to add in the amount the attendee is required to pay to book an appointment. Is it a group type appointment? And finally, will your attendee want to bring guests? You can enable these options to expand your meetings further than just one-to-one -one sessions. Now, if you are happy with your appointment, go ahead and create it. Now, all that's left to do is copy the link and share. Stay tuned to learn about poll meetings, which is also available here. Additionally, best practices on sharing your link. If you need any support, feel free to book a call with our experts. I will leave you to it. Happy scheduling. Thanks for watching.